Here we are at Arthur 5th and 6th, the reconstruction project, in Missoula, Montana, early September 2011. The project is completed as far as this major phase, adding this northbound lane up the bridge, separating the two southbound lanes into right turn only and through only. New stoplight at Arthur 5th. Coming up the bridge, two lanes reduced to one. Down ahead at Maurice, there's a two-way cycle track with some separation. There's a couple extra sidewalks, a couple extra bike lanes, a bike box. Sharrows on this northbound leg. which crosses over this northbound lane and then over the bridge. At the Missoula Institute for Sustainable Transportation, this project seems to be a step in the right direction when compared to the original five-lane proposed expansion primarily by the state of Montana. We helped lead the effort to change that proposal to a more human-scale three-lane and save some houses from being torn down. Our concerns with this so-called compromise plan is the light at Arthur 5th when a modern single lane roundabout very likely would have performed very, very well for safety and efficiency and equitable transportation. This could have been one lane in each direction, single lane roundabout Arthur 5th, single lane at Arthur 6th. And our proposal was to turn this leg here into an active transportation, i.e. walking and biking Greenway from 5th all the way to Broadway, warranting a single lane roundabout at Broadway and Madison, warranting a four-lane to three-lane conversion on Broadway from Orange to Van Buren. We still believe this is the best plan for the future of Missoula, but also realize systems cannot be changed overnight and probably should not be changed overnight, but gradual steps involving community, making some compromise, holding ground on other values and beliefs, primarily building community while building sustainable transportation. Yet on the other hand, we have people dying on our roads, we have climate change issues, resource conflicts, and an intense desire in many places throughout the United States and here in Missoula for better walking and biking facilities and less dependence on oil and the automobile. Let us know if you have ideas, know of examples of good transportation planning, design, implementation, maintenance. strans.org is our website. And we encourage you to be involved in your community. Voices do matter. Road projects are not solely the purview of engineers or planners, it's everyone, road users, community members. We have to think about the landscape, wildlife, our water, our air, and how it all comes together in the one system.